Hello viewers and welcome back to my channel again today. My name is Fam Nkechi. I'm happy to have us back today. I'm going to discuss some habits that makes us to have low energy. Having very high energy levels is very desirable. Positive vibes is very desirable. But there, is a, there are challenges that can cause one to have low energy, but whether it's at home, at the workplace, and for students even at school. It has been studied and deduced that there are some, se some several bad habits or negative lifestyle factors that can be attributable to these low energy levels. So let us look at these factors one after the other. Identifying and correcting these negative factors can help us to switch our energy levels from low energy level to high energy levels. So let's look at them one after the other. The very first one is inadequate sleep. Sleep is very important. It's the body's natural way of recovering from stress and the activities of the previous day. So when one does not have enough sleep, what happens is that the body is weak. And when the body is weak, the person's energy level is very low. Now, the person might try to adjust by trying to work overtime to recover from past activities that are yet to be done. And what happens is that there's a negative feedback mechanism. The body does not get more sleep again and it goes over and over again. So when we make our time to have adequate sleep, the body is well recovered and it can be able to go on at its pace at the fullest energy level possible. The second point that we should look at now is dwelling on the past. Our past belongs to where it is, the past. So the best way to relate with the past is to try and let go of anger, resentment, bitterness, all these negative effect, factors and feelings have a way of weighing us down naturally. And you know what? The best thing that is most impacted is you. And that is why we should let go of anger, resentment, forget the past. Let's try to where they belong to our past and forge ahead. So let's learn to let go of things, animosities and bitterness and forge ahead so that we can convert negative energy to positive, vibrant energy level. Third point, dehydration. Dehydration impacts negatively on the functioning of the brain. What happens is that on our, daily, daily, on our daily normal activities, the body is actually losing water to sweating, urination, and for people that are on some medications, they could be losing a lot of fluids from the body. So it becomes necessary to rehydrate the body by taking sufficient water. When we fail to take water sufficiently, the body is losing so much water and also dehydration impacts on the electrolyte balance of the body. All these factors can result in negative energy too, loss of energy. Fourth is sedentary lifestyle. This plunges the body naturally into low energy levels and a lot of fatigue. And the reason is simple. The body is created in a way that it has to be active, especially during the day. So, sedentary lifestyle makes the body to go into low energy levels very fast, faster than we could think. Fifth is lack of regular exercise and workout. Exercise boosts the body's strength naturally and helps the body to endure better. It also helps the cardiovascular system of the body to function properly. Exercising regularly also makes it possible for nutrients and oxygen to be delivered to the tissues for normal functioning of the body. And that is no wonder when people exercise regularly, they are always in good form, they are always in high spirits, they are always in good energy levels. The sixth factor we will look at now is poor diet. A healthy, well-balanced diet provides the body with all the nutrients that it needs for optimal functioning. And that is why when we eat very well, we are energized naturally. So if you want to have a lot of positive energy, positive vibes, make sure you keep out of junk foods. Eat healthy always and you find yourself in good 
energy levels regularly. The seventh point is associating with toxic people. We have to avoid associating with toxic people for us to be in good energy level. People who are always complaining after one thing or the other, they are always criticizing, always bringing negative vibes and energy around us. No, we should keep away from such people. Instead, let us surround ourselves with like-minded, positive people. And also, we should bring in some positivity into our own relationship with other people. So when we are surrounded by positive people, we find our energy level growing and getting more exciting every day. I hope this is a great discussion we've had today. Let me know if you have any value from this discussion. As usual, I'd like you to share your comments, share the video, like it, and if you're new to my channel, please subscribe. And I'm looking forward to having another exciting one with you next week. Enjoy the rest of your day. Bye.